With fears of a recession, families are cutting back in lots of places, but there are some small luxuries people are not giving up. KXLY4 Sally Showman is live in North Spokane with the story of some local businesses that continue to thrive. Sally. Robin, in times like the, these, economists say that people feel somewhat deprived, so they turn to the little luxuries like going to the movies, chocolate, and liquor. We have a chocolate pharmacy where people can be healed through the power of chocolate. People sickened by the economy, well, these are from Seattle, okay. mm -hmm. are turning out in big numbers for a dose of chocolate at the Chocolate Apothecary in Spokane. Business is so good, they've decided to expand, adding franchises across the country. I think people are seeking comfort, someplace they can go and feel relaxed, feel comforted. From comforting food to comforting drinks, alcohol sales in both Idaho and Washington show people are pouring more money into their spirits. Liquor seems to be an affordable luxury for folks. In Idaho, liquor sales are up 6.5% over this time last year. In Washington, sales are up about 7%. And increasingly, customers are treating themselves to top-shelf liquor. One thing we've really noticed is people are really upscaling. So they're going from the, the bottom-level liquor and actually upscaling to get some more of the expensive products. Thank you, for you guys. We're here to give people a cheap night out. And Garland Theater is drawing in hundreds of people for Dollar Movie Wednesdays. According to managers, that's a marked increase from previous years. It seems to, yeah, continue to get bigger every week. It's all a temporary escape from the bigger picture. We're happy to be, so far, a little bit recession-proof. I also checked on lottery tickets. Sales remain steady there. They say that this economy hasn't affected people's dreams of making it big. In North Spokane, Sally Showman, KXLY4 HD News.